How's it going guys? Benny Childs, founder of the Teach Me to Fish Effects Trading Community, back with another video. Just going to do a quick market review and a um, uh, projected targets for tomorrow. Um, I'm here on the daily chart. As you guys can see, uh, the today's target was hit at $18,062.25. So right off the bat, uh, my initial uh, target uh, for Wednesday is going to be Tuesday's high. So I'm going to go ahead and, and put that in there. Um, so I'll be looking for that to hit. And we'll just do Wednesday. All right. Buy side liquidity for that. All right. So again, the daily candle swept Monday's low and closed above. All right. So again, I'm expecting it to at least take out today's. Uh, um, I'm sorry. I'm at least expecting Wednesday to take out Tuesday's to take out Tuesday's high. Okay. All right. Let's drop down to the four hour. Let's see what we're looking looking like. All right, so um, this is looking pretty bullish, okay? Uh, this high created this low, and we had a displacement or a close above that low, all right? So we will be uh, currently uh, bullish. Let's see if we can project where where it may go. Let's see here. Let's see if there's a OTE, possible OTE. Sorry. <laughs> I just can't get my fit. All right. So, um, I really don't see anything that really catches my eye here on the four hour. Let's take a look at the one hour. Um, just gonna lock that. Let's see here on the one hour. I mean, we do have uh, this liquidity right here um, that has already rebalanced um, that fair value gap. That fair value gap could get filled. Um, I really don't see any equal highs. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. So it's very possible it could go up to to fill that here let's take a look at the daily let's see if there are any possible daily targets um I mean, we could come up to the high here at eighteen thousand five hundred six dollars and seventy five cents um uh, my weekly target is still open so um and plus we have high impact news coming out uh, tomorrow at 2 and 2.30 FOMC. Uh, so we could see bullish price action throughout the day. And then when the news hit, they could use that to drive the market down to possibly hit uh, the weekly target. Um, or, you know, if not, then... Um, it will continue up. Um, we did have the consequent encroachment of this daily fair value gap close below. So I, I still think we can see uh, the market go lower. Uh, but there are probably just some buy side objectives the algorithm wants to meet uh, before heading there. Um, could be looking to close above uh this daily volume imbalance as well so but you guys know I, I pretty much I take the market uh, one tick at a time I do have my bias and what I think the market may do and so in this instance I'm thinking that tomorrow my initial target is going to be $18,289.50 uh, so of course I'll be on the lower time frame uh, looking for um, a possible entry I would love to see the market uh, open up and uh, push down and then take that 
that target but if not it can go ahead and take that target and then start working its way down to uh, the weekly um, target uh, that I set uh, this past weekend so all right guys uh, that's what I'm looking for that's what I think um, hopefully this was uh, helpful until the next time uh, I upload a video I hope you all stay well and happy trading bye